headlines for you this midday. A three-year-old was transported to the hospital after accidentally being shot by a neighbor last night. Police say it was the 5500 block of Seawall Court in Virginia Beach. And 10 on your side's Melanie Woodrow spoke to a woman who says her husband was the one who accidentally fired his handgun. Melanie? That's right. She answered her door. She lives just upstairs from where this three year old was shot. She answered the door with a six month old little boy in her arms and told me immediately that it was her husband who accidentally fired his handgun last night that shot that three year old. She did not want to talk to us on camera because she said her husband is in the Navy. Still off camera, she provided a lot of information. According to her, her husband was um, preparing to dismantle the gun last night, to disarm it. She said that he was putting the safety lock on, taking the bullets out of the chamber, and that one bullet was left in the chamber, and that is when the gun, according to her, accidentally went off. Now, obviously, her and her husband immediately heard that sound. She also says that just moments later, somebody from downstairs came upstairs to say the three-year-old had been shot. Now, she said that her husband or police could not locate the bullet. They couldn't locate the bullet hole in what was their floor and obviously the ceiling to the apartment below. Still, obviously, despite that, that three-year-old was shot, even though they couldn't find that hole through what was her floor and the ceiling to below. The woman tells me that her husband um, obviously did this accidentally, according to her, and that is why police are saying that he will not be facing any charges. Some neighbors we spoke to were pretty upset about that. To me, I mean, it's ridiculous because if you're, if you have a gun in your house, you should have it on safety to where it's not going to discharge. Things like this happens, and that's why they say don't play with your guns in the house. A three-year-old getting hurt is ridiculous to me, and him not being charged. I mean, even if it's a minor charge, any charge should, will be better than no charge at all. And now, obviously, you may have heard that man say something about him potentially playing with the weapon. The woman I spoke to, of course, again, not saying this. She says that he was disarming his weapon, and that is when it accidentally went off. Uh, now, the family of the three-year-old did not answer their door this morning. The latest information we have from police regarding the three-year-old's condition is only that it was a non-life-threatening injury. Also, one more piece of information here. The woman upstairs tells me the reason her and her husband keep a loaded weapon is because because they were burglarized in the past or somebody tried to break into their home when she was alone with her child. Again, they're saying this is a terrible accident. She is very upset. She says she's also concerned that her husband could be disciplined or possibly even discharged from the Navy. We're going to continue to gather information on this story. We're reaching out to the Virginia Beach Commonwealth Attorney to get a better understanding, even though there was no criminal intent here, even though police are also saying that this is an accident, why there are no charges that are being filed in this case. We'll have all of that information for you coming up tonight, beginning on Wavy News 10 at 5. Reporting live in Virginia Beach, Melanie Woodrow, 10 on your side.